Hey everyone, welcome back. So kind of a short one today again, but we did get all the posts in the ground. The wind stopped blowing 100 miles an hour for one day. It's still blowing today, but kind of normal, only about 40. So we got it in. I was able to get the camera set up to film it. It's still lashed down to my snow plow, but you know, we make do with what we can around here. Um, but we got all the posts in the ground, we set them on those concrete footings um, and then we backfilled them with gravel to help keep the water away from them so they'll last a good long time. These are fence posts so they are CCA treated. Like I said in the last video they're going to be, or they're treated with kind of the old stuff that's supposed to be better but we'll see. So next step is to get some timbers to stretch across those. We've got the posts in the ground and they are kind of right on the money. Um, you saw me using that tape measure to make sure that they're right on the nuts. We really didn't need them to be perfectly square, but it sure helps out in the long run. So we did that. Um, so progress is happening. Pretty cool. Um, and we're just going to keep right on rolling. We'll get the platform done and we'll get the timbers coming and we'll start cutting that dove, dovetail log shed. So thanks for tuning in guys. Sorry the videos have been a little bit sparse, but you know, it's the holidays and everyone's busy and you know, what can I tell you? So, but we are moving along as you can see and the progress is starting to pick up again and we'll be kind of hitting her pretty steady from now on. So hit that like button if you like the channel and if you're going to like, you know, seeing me build this dovetail log shed, should, should be a pretty cool project. Um, sure helps the channel when you do that. Be sure and subscribe if you're a new subscriber or a new viewer. And uh, as always, Facebook and Instagram. Got other stuff on those platforms that we don't always have here. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time.